true. Yeah, the, and the and last... what, I think Porzingis is back for game one, right? Yeah, back. It, oh, yeah well, Porzingis is back. So, yeah, that makes a difference as well. He, yeah, they asked him about his return. I think we've got Porzingis' video here of uh, him ahead of game one. Yeah, I've uh, practiced, especially the lighter practices. I was, I was good. Um, of course, not a lot of time for me to uh, to get a lot of scrimmaging, a lot of you know, or you know, no game actual game minutes. Mm -hmm. So in that sense, it hasn't been perfect, obviously. Um, but uh, but yeah, I've, I've you know tried to build up as much as I can leading up to this point, and and you know, from like all aspects, you know, and and and, um, and yeah, and. We'll see. A couple more days will we'll definitely help. I, I, I'm going to go on another side. And I, you know, and I, want, I wanted Dallas. You know, I, I wanted Dallas. I'm happy for them to be in the finals. I wanted them to do something. But I just can't, I can't pick over Boston because I feel like Boston this season, they done been down this road. They done, you've seen them trending. They got to win the championship. They won, what, five conference finals? They've been to the conference finals five out of the last seven years. They got to get it. The, they went this to the finals. This is the only step left. So yeah. that's the only step left. Like, I think they so locked in on winning this championship because they don't everything we talk about these kids these young kids got to go through to get to that next level i feel like they done did that they done went through everything as young guys you know what I'm because they've been going making conference finals since they've second third year in the league mm -hmm. so they've been making them they've been making runs so i just think it's time i think you know the mindset is going to be totally different i think they learned a lot from the first time they went in terms of everything that comes with going to the finals the media responsibility of the, the family the all this, everything that comes with it, the whole social yeah. media, just everybody talking about it. I think they, they've learned to tune that noise out. And I think, you know, Dallas going through it for the first time, I think it may overwhelm them. Yeah. So that's why I'm picking Boston because I just think Boston is just, they just primed and ready to uh, win, their, win, win um, the first championship with this group. Yeah. Porzingis hadn't played since April 29th. You better be well, hungry. Well over a month. What do we expect from him? You better be hungry. Just the fucking finals. You better be hungry. Yeah. You gotta be hungry. This ain't this ain't first round. This ain't second round. You know what I'm saying? This the finals. This yeah. is it. Yeah. This yeah. it. Ain't ain't no more games tomorrow. Or like, oh, I'll be better next week or in two weeks. No, this it. You better wrap that motherfucking uh, little non-muscle calf up <laughs> and go out there and get and get Where that shit. Stupid, bro? You know what I'm saying? That's mm. that's what that's what he got to do because. Here's my opinion. I think they have a better chance. I still think Dallas is going to get it. Either way. But I think either way. I think they have a better chance for sure, hands down, with him than without him. For sure. Oh, even with the rust? <coughs> even, even, even with, with the rust. The, okay, even, even with shaking well, off a month of rust. It no, it ain't going to be too much rust yeah. like that because as Bonzi always tell us, motherfuckers ain't practicing. And he even said it in the thing, you know, it no ain't practice. no scrimmaging, it ain't no practice. He getting shots up. But it's so, playoff, he got injured first round. He didn't even really get no playoff know, minutes but, in. He but, jumping into the final. Like you said, this is the finals. So I got to be running. ready. I'm all in. How do you stay ready? Or how do you, like, you ever had a long layoff like that injury-wise and had to jump back into the, the yeah. playoffs or later yeah. rounds? How do you? I mean, I don't know about that. <laughs> not, not, no, not jump back in the playoffs late round. I mean, yearly injuries, like, yeah, right. but. No, playoffs, dog, playoffs. You got to suck it up. Yeah, and it's, still just, it up. and it's still just hoop. You know, he know how to hoop. Yeah. You know what I mean? And he got a team around him that made it to the finals without him. Without him. You know what I mean? <laughs> so ain't no pressure right. on him. Ain't like he got to go out there and get 30. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? No pressure on him. like he was leading scorer. Yeah, everything is icing on the cake for him right now because they already done got the D. White stepped up. Um, Horford stepped up. Everybody yep. was I'll stepping up for them yeah. guys. You know what I'm saying? And now if you, could, if you just come in and give us a – you know what I'm saying? Give Boston, I'm sorry, say give Boston, fifth, you know, anything double anything figures. Anything on the positive. Yeah, anything double figures. Just don't have no negative minutes. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. If you, if, if you want to get your rhythm, go start rebounding. You know what I'm saying? Get some easier shots before you start shooting jumpers. You see something go through the hole, get your feel, and, 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 you know, then take off from there. But if you come out thinking you're in that same rhythm, shooting threes and shooting jumpers, and then you start missing, hi, that could get between your ears. Everybody looking sideways, say he ain't ready, and then, you know, you never know. But if he just gets some easy basket, gets some rebounds, go ahead and get those few bumps out the way, you know what I'm saying, or whatever, I think he'll be fine. But anything over double figures is a plus for them hey, right now. You start couple. him? Yeah. You know Minutes limit or I mean, you just oh, or see yeah, how the game play. Well, yeah, well no, it's, it's, it's protocol he going to get a minutes limit. Right? Yeah. You know After what I'm saying? It, which is yeah. fucked up because it's the, it's the finals. But 
still you those those minutes that he do get like you know let's say first quarter let's say he gets uh uh four and a half five, five minutes, minutes. You know what I'm saying? So in those minutes. four and a half, five minutes, I got to be impactful. Yeah. Because I know, I know as a player in my head, I'm coming out at the seven, seven, seven and a half minute mark. Right. I'm no coming out. Almost, you right. know what I'm saying? So let me go ahead and do the everything, no matter if it's, I'm going to set the shit out some screens. I'm going to, mm -hmm. you know, tip the ball out, crashing the offensive board, yeah. whatever it may be. I'm going to make these first five, four and a half, five minutes impactful. Yeah. yeah. So if you're the Mavs, put on the coach hand for a minute. You going right at him immediately, right? How do you for attack? Sure. How do you attack <clears throat> him? Oh, definitely, yeah. definitely. I mean, you put him in all the screen and rolls, but that's what they do anyway. You know what I'm saying? That's what they do anyway. They're gonna put him in a bunch of screen and rolls. They're gonna. I think I, I totally expect them to try to attack Al Horford because they think he's older. Put him in a lot of screen and rolls. Make him switch out on Luca and see if he can dance. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? You know, because Al's. I, I totally see that strategy right there. But yeah, you attack him. But on the on the flip side, you know, Boston, you know, you you want if you're gonna get four and a half, five minutes out of him in the first quarter, call a couple plays for him and stuff to see what he's talking about. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Get him exactly. a couple baskets, get him, you know, see to see what he working with. Get his early. feet wet. Get his feet mm -hmm. wet. It's like, you know, put you know, but you gotta start him. You know, you put him out there and you see, and you see what it is. But I think Dallas is definitely gonna attack him as soon as they see him out there because that's Got his, to. that's his basketball one on one. You know what I'm saying? If somebody was injured and hurt, we know about it, let's attack it. You know right. what I'm saying? If he got a knee brace on his right knee, we going left all night and see if he can slide to go to that right knee. You know what I'm saying? What? And vice versa. Right. So, you know, that's just basketball one on one. Mm -hmm. Do we think Luca's gonna make this personal? Considering like they played together and the way it seemed like KP wanted a little bit more of a role than he had. Probably more closer to the role he has now, like that third well, score. Back I, then he was still, you know, he was coming off that all star run in New York. Yeah, true, but no, nah, he's he's not the scorer that Luca is. You know, and then it's just the fact that, you know, it's the way it goes sometimes. Luca actually ended up getting drafted by a team that needed what? A score. Sure. Mm -hmm. You know, they, 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 and they had the, the good feeling. Dallas had the good feeling about it anyway because, you know, they drafted a, a great score in Dirk. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, all right, that's shit. That worked for us the first time. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Seriously. Let's see, let's see if we could, you know, work this shit again. And boom, here it is. Now we got Luca. So I think with, the way that they, the way that Dallas scores this ball, I mean, of course, we know the main two guys is Kyrie mm. and Luke. But mm. with with Porzingis coming back, that to me that gives Boston that third score that they do need. Because other than that, we know to be white being score. I mean, well, with that fourth, yeah, you're right. Yeah, that, that fourth score, you know, because as you said before, we don't need you to go out here and get uh -uh. 25 or 30. Uh -uh. Your ten or your your ten, twelve or fourteen Double figures. would would just need that definitely every help single us. Night. Yeah, you know what I'm every saying? Because night. you are coming back from injury, and again, as you said, that pressure ain't on him. But no, it's it's, it's going to be interesting. As I said, I think Dallas has. I mean, excuse me, uh, Boston has a better chance. Mm. Their chances are better with Porzingis, but I still think Dallas is going to take it. Mm.